oh, yeah. barbarians were going to do their, um, you know, ah, oh, shoot, what's that? It's their war Wolf cry move or whatever, where it bolsters their morale oh, all by them bang their, banging their spears against their shields. I love it when uh, they when you can time your javelin throw. So just as they're going, yeah, yeah come on, take a come ass, bro, you throw javelins in their face. Like, it's like yeah. take that I for can, your morale. I can shout really loud. I will get stronger. Just like in Dragon Ball Z. Stop. That didn't work. That, did, that didn't happen in Dragon Ball Z. Stab. Yep. Let's see. Let's not too bad you're not fighting head throwers. I love those guys. Oh yeah, the head throwers. Head throwers. Ah, we'll, we'll probably face them sooner or later anyway. Oh, that's right. They're a Britain exclusive faction. Yeah. Faction, I think. Yes, I mean, not faction. British exclusion faction. Unit. Come on. Yes. No, don't charge in. Don't charge in. No, okay. Fine, screw you then. We've got armor. What do you have? Except for blood spears. And shields. Yeah. But we got uh, armor. Hey, it's that classic. Hey, you know, actually, there are. I don't know whether it works for men though, but I mean they should be more dangerous than your troops because going by video games, the less armor you wear, the more protected you are. At oh least yeah, the female, yeah, yeah. So yeah, better hope it doesn't apply to men. Yeah, yeah, especially especially the uh, uh, yeah, and that's why the female elves are so so brutal. I swear to God, every, exactly. every time I go against an a, um, um, a female a female um, elf in um. MMORPG, I always lose. Level 8 is like a level 10. It's like, oh, okay, oh, wait, dog. Oh, okay, they're not getting any clothes. That logic there. Yep, we're screwed. <laughs> oh, God. Like, oh, God, we got think... this guy. <laughs> yeah. Yes, you think, come on, what's that armor gonna do? How's that gonna defend you? Yes. Uh, and it's like the oh. arrows magically hit only the places where they'll deflect off. And it's like, yeah. what the heck? Yeah, she just committed suicide now. On those last couple guys running away. I do love this game is so good with the that you can actually win a battle through morale just by making the enemy, you know, all run away. If you kill their general and you know tire them out, you can actually just get them to all flee. And I just think that's such a you know uh, interesting strategic element as opposed yeah. to other games where it's just like the nope. You know, you, if you've killed every single one of their men except for five, those last five guys are still gonna fight to the death because they're crazy. Yeah, because they're suicidal. I mean, good for those guys, they're running away. Of course, their AI is making them run to the center of town, which means they're all going to die. Yes, yeah, oh, be uh. yeah, because they want to worship this giant lock. Because I don't know why. This magical power, it's like a magnet. Must be one of the rocks of Stonehenge or something. Oh, like yeah. That. Oh. Actually, well, what I want to do is. um. I want to get the general out of there, so I can avoid fighting him as well as the other two units. Um, all this just now one thing that is really cool, but it takes perfect timing and it, a lot of times it hardly ever works. If you're being laid siege to by a vastly superior army, I've noticed that their general will wait until all the rest of their troops are on the way into the into sack your city and then they'll come and join the fight so if you can send out a couple of your cavalry to flank around sometimes they can kill the general while he's all alone on a hill and deal a massive blow to the enemy's morale but go. it takes split timing out in there causing devastation you killed my dogs how dare you the spirit of the Fiends. war dogs live on not in those guys but the ones who will kill you yeah, so when you've got them flanked from all sides now, they're, yeah. they're pretty much dead. Well, they should be. Yes, yes balance, it, it's definitely even, I swear, it's, it's definitely even point. Definitely. Totally. Yep, beat victory all around. Yep, oh, I did another thing I hate about this game sometimes, but that, that the game just basically, if if they, if one unit is automatically is going to die, they just give like a level up or something. Oh yes, exactly. It's the it's like well, you did your best. You can have a level up. You're going to die anyway. But yeah. there you go. That never happened in. That never happened to us, of course. That happened to the players. But you know, I know you're AI. right. Yeah, you're right. I never see my guys level up. It's always the enemy soldiers leveling up. Yeah. I call hacks. Damn it. 
Uh, maybe it has something to do with the difficulty setting, maybe easier difficulty settings. Um, no, your guys no, level yeah, faster. I, yeah, I actually play sometimes on easy as well, and um, if they still level up, just as they're about to die. And these could actually level up twice if you if you look carefully, which is unfair. Mm. Yes, that is totally and completely uh, insane. It's like yes, we're going to die, but we've got to level hot. Take that. So how is that going to help you? I don't know. Uh, it is. Yes, and they managed to destroy all of my. They really them did manage to actually destroy most of my um, infantry. What the hell? You're all supposed to be yeah. dead now, you stupid general. And maybe the general had like a. He must have a steel skin, or it's not called that, but you know, a, a bonus two hit points oh. um, attribute. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, not about the digital general. General I forget what they call it. They call it like, you know, scarred or something like that. Oh, and it makes you tougher. Yay. Oh, if he hadn't stopped right then to blow his horn and rear his horse all dramatically. Yeah, uh, yeah, it's such a shame, man. It's such a shame. And he's just, oh god, the house bears. The house bears are throwing it at me. Oh no. Uh, he survived? What the heck? Uh, oh no. yeah, he's dead. Yay. Okay. Um, the surviving force. Oh, you barely reach 80, but why not? Um, the see, the wow, they did do a lot of damage to your ranks there. Yeah, this full of. Um, but yeah, I, I, I do not envy the, the um, graveyard keeper at all. Yes, definitely. That's a good point. Who cleans up after these battles? Uh, Ooh, more Jones. Why not? But to be fair, that was a good spear though, my men with there. Just did they quite decent that about 30. Oh actually, hold on. Wow, that could do quite a bit. Jesus Christ. That was an excellent throw. Oh, hey, look on. at all those dead bodies there. Yeah, I'm, I'm hold on, I think it's because of the war dog or just all the spear I don't know. And I don't care the dead but and uh, yeah, everyone's like, no! They're topless! Ah, they're gonna kill us all! Dang it. I'll and get your general in there blowing his horn. It does, it does, trust me, it does help. It doesn't always snap yeah, out of it, but yeah, it does yeah, sometimes. I, yeah, I actually tried that um, during that the, um, I, uh, I forgot which battle it was now. It, it was, it was on... Wasn't it the one it where your it? general died? No, or? no, it, it, it wasn't that one. He didn't even get a chance to blow his horn. Oh, that's right, yeah. Yeah. But yeah, it does actually work. It just has a chance of, you know, depending on how scared your guys are. It won't always work, but it does help. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Well, good to get busting mercenaries. Mercenary scum. Yeah. Uh, well, 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 in any event, these are pretty good mercenaries. Just because, if anything, yes, you know, just there. Yes, yeah, I'd love the. Hoplite mercenaries, I always get those guys. Yeah. Those guys are epic. Those are spearmen. It's like, come on, they've got the long spears and they've got the phalanx. Yeah, long Formation. spears. Oh my. <laughs> yes. Yeah, that, that was going to be one eventually. That was going to be one eventually. Um, yeah, if I destroyed them, they're still running scared. I see. Hmm. I'm going to disband you. Just so you know. Uh, hopefully. Hopefully when they get and they're running through those other troops and see those troops aren't running, maybe your general blows his horn one more time, they'll snap out of it. Uh, but okay. they did, to be fair, they did take pretty heavy casualties, and yeah, when they, you uh, yeah, they, get they down to 15 men... Most. Yeah, but these are Romans! Yeah, that's still. Oh, well, a couple of them have stopped fleeing, so that's good. No. God damn it. No. Stop, 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 Oh, thank God for that. Do that first, do your war cry, then charge in the back of them. <laughs> and they're all facing the other way, they're like, no, we're not going to look at you. Look, no, we we're right fighting with our... Uh, oh, no. Kill them, kill them now, kill them now, kill them now. Oh, they did their own war cry. Uh, I was thinking that those are, you know, mercenaries that you recruited in this area, so maybe they were like, no, we, we used to know you guys, we used to think we were friends, but then you came and worked for the Romans, so we're not even going to look at you, we turn our backs yeah. on you. The mercenaries like, okay, stab. It's like, oh, oh, okay, fair enough. They give us money. Sweet, stab in the face. Um, 
Yet a little. Yet is it always one where he wants to be Bruce Lee? Always one guy. And no, I'm not going to say Chuck Norris because those are overrated. Bruce Lee yeah. won that fight in May of the Dragon. And, um. Sorry, are they actually doing anything or. So we should have this in the back then if if, if um if I'm mercenary with like nope. Look at us, I was like, oh, see, I wanna fight, but oh, I see my arms tired, you know. Um yeah, that'd be horrible. The mercenaries hit you up for more money mid battle. Yeah. It's like, like, well, well what's how it's like yeah, well well we usually know like oh so we want like an extra thousand, you know. Like, they really you ask for a thousand when you're when they're about to stab you in the back. Wait, what? Okay. Uh, Never mind. Yeah, they turn around and get stabbed. Ah, uh, that got him. Um, yeah, the unit runs away. Disgrace! Shameful disgrace! Ah, um, a little thing from <laughs> Shogun too there. Oh boy! Yeah, stop playing that game. Yeah. I need to. Oh, by the way, in case you didn't, people know, Jan actually is going to start his own Let's Play soon. So, subscribe yep, to Indeed, him. I'm just, yeah, exactly, I'm just bolstering my computer a little bit. Yeah. Oh, but, oh by the way, um, do, um, there's a website you can check out called canyourunit.com. It's basically lets you, it's basically analyzes your computer and basically um, tells you what games you can and can't play. I mean, it's actually a very useful tool, but it's as a um, limited um, selection, let's say. Yes, see, I should should use that to see, because I'll know I'll need to be able to run uh, whatever game I play at like really good settings without Fraps running to be able to run it at even medium or passable settings with Fraps. Yeah. So my computer's just too slow. Yeah. Yeah, it might be they can't run that many games because uh, it's, it's a graphics card, it's absolute crap. Um, so it's very sad things about that. But, um, um, I, but as I said, um, this this one part of the war game will be for a quite long time, so, you know, by the, by the end of it, I shall get, like, I shall get a new graphics card when, it, when it's over. A microphone you don't have to hold, and you'll it'll be all set. Yes. It'd be like, yeah, yeah I can finally produce some awesome ones like Rome 2, and then get plenty of views from that. Yes, exactly. Yeah, so because of, oh, hopefully, if, if everything goes to plan, I'll then um, wait. What am I watching these for? We just watch the one in the middle. Um. Yeah. Because uh, by then, hopefully, I'll get a new computer, or at least a new graphics card, and then I can get Rome 2, and then I can, um, I, I, I can put an Earth Play on what day comes out, and then get lots of views for it, and I can get many subscribers, hopefully. I don't know why, but, you know. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I still probably should. Do that whole subscribing thing I yeah. have. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm surprised you haven't have subscribed yet. You're like all the Oh, hello, that's a good one. Like, like, like. Oh, there was something I forgot to do now. What was it now? Um, um. I know, sorry, I need to go ahead and do that. I just, for the longest time, I never even had an account on YouTube and I just watched the videos yeah. without doing any posting comments or liking or subscribing or anything. And then I've just finally now started actually doing that. So. It's been a slow process, so I'm finally to the point where I uh, might as well subscribe. Well, we'll it was just fair. that thing with... Yeah. Okay, in all honesty, I was like that before um, on my old channel. Because mm -hmm. before, I used to be Nightmare203. But, um... But, um, when I got onto other things, oh, like Emma and, and victory. such, the, the, no, the username 203 was um, basically taken, I was like, what? That's why the um, 6-5 came into play. Yes, mm -hmm. because yeah. anyway, I was like, oh, let's see what, let's see what num add two numbers, which one I have? I don't look, I don't like the um, look of that seven. That's an evil number. Victory! Eight <laughs> looks a bit, mm, eight looks a bit bloated. 
nine. No, no, it's a bit bent and old. I already used all ones. This straight. Two I use. <laughs> three I use. Four's just weird. No one wants to know four. Five and six. Perfect. Just <laughs> uh, they're so conveniently placed between seven and four. Yes. Very, very convenient that, yes. Set some that's forward to the might of your armies. Victory is yours and the face them right in your hands. Let's see, uh... So do you enslave or exterminate? Uh, see, uh, that is the ultimate question. Um, they killed my war dogs. So I'm gonna exterminate. Yes, yeah, so exterminate gives you. you more money. Exterminate gives you more money, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay. I, th I think in the long run, though, it decreases it, like the overall amount it, um... Well, exactly, well, it kills a bunch of your population, so... It means yeah, it see, then the takes a long time. It's 400, they can't recruit Jackal now. But in all honesty, no one cares, it's just a town. No one's gonna miss it. Oh fuck, I've... I was gonna think that it gives you a little bit better, um, you know, happiness. Yeah, Strangely, uh, because they all know what happens if they stop being happy. Yeah, yeah, be happy! Be goddamn happy! Huh. Yeah. So remember kids, be happy. Otherwise, I'm going to, I'm going to behead you. Okay, Something like okay, that. Okay, yeah. And oh, there's a faction leader. There. Oh no. Quick, peasant. Oh, okay. Yeah, town watch. Because you have shields. those guys and their styling mustaches. Yeah, I can It did me, Mario. Oh god, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I should have done that. So that. That's that's just that's racist, and I'm, I'm I apologize sincerely. What? That's okay. I forgive you. Yeah. Um, well, uh, there we are. Let's uh, see. Um, I talk out that. I can you need to be in there. Not about to Shoot now. I'm trying to remember that button that lets you see the capital. I can't remember it. It's somewhere in there. That's uh, not epic. Ah. Mm. Uh, was it? Settlement. Oh no. Okay. Uh, make sure I do. This one, yeah. He's like, okay, so, so how do we do this? I click on it so that it brings up. Click on the settlement, I mean, there. Settlement, okay, I clicked it. And then, um. It should be one of those buttons on the side there next to the little face. This is one of those show. Next to the face.